One of the easiest ways to add an author bio image to WordPress is through the service Gravatar. In a nutshell, you sign up for a Gravatar account and no matter whose site you're on, the same author bio image will show up. All right, to get started, let's head on over to Gravatar.com. If you don't have a WordPress.com account, it will ask you to make one. But if you do, go ahead and sign in. From the dashboard, you can add an email address or you can add a new image. Let's go ahead and click add a new image. From here, you could either upload new from URL from your webcam or use one of your past uploads. I'll just click from URL and I'll paste in my link and click next. Keep in mind there is a 10 megabyte file size limit for uploading and they will automatically resize super large images. All right, so our avatar needs to be square. So at this point, it's time to crop your image. If you uploaded a square image, there's no cropping necessary unless you wanted to punch in a little bit closer. I'll just go ahead and move this to where I would like. I could even kind of bring this in a little bit closer. The controls down here help you center your crop box and you could also just align it to the left or to the right. Once we feel good about it, we can go ahead and click crop image. Now at this point, we need to choose a rating for your Gravatar. Site owners can actually block avatars that are rated, let's say PG, R, or X. So make sure you rate your avatar accordingly. This one is pretty harmless, so we'll leave it at G and click set rating. Just like that, my brand new Gravatar is now up and running. Your Gravatar will automatically populate to your website and anywhere else you've commented with that email address. It's really that simple. Now I should probably go ahead and remove this because I'm not actually Michael Scott. And there you go, it's as simple as that. If you enjoyed this video, then be sure to give it a like and subscribe for more content. With that said, thanks for watching and we'll catch you in the next one.